Welcome to Fort Lauderdale, where we take the 10-day enchanted cruise on Princess, and we had a great time. So I'm going to go over everything in detail of all the stops that we stopped at, all the ports, um, what was included, what's not included, all the food, of course. The food was delicious. The main dining and also the speciality dining, paid and non-paid. And so also the Lido deck. Um, that was a really good one all the theater shows all the new year's eve party that we had the massage the gym we have to include that one in there all the activities that they had on board the awesome casino the take five the laundromat all right guys hi welcome to our channel restaurant, restaurant tour travels. travels so we just yeah we just got done with the uh 10 night uh, princess cruise our first time on a princess cruise this is my ninth time on a cruise this is her i think eighth, eighth. time um we've done we just did a norwegian prima if you watch the other one uh it was in uh it left uh halloween october 31st of this year and it was a 11 night out of galveston to miami um we we won't go to norwegian probably again just because princess was so much awesome you know like we just left with a um good taste in our mouth literally you know? like yeah literally <laughs> uh we just watched the production show the last one was like a boy band motown something that was awesome it was like called the company men um they had really good um production shows so we're basically going to give you a rundown of everything before we actually get into the video and go over everything in detail but First of all, I want to tell you from day one to now, which is our last day, we're literally about to put our suitcases out and then they're the right show here. is over. <laughs> yeah, this right, they're yeah. right here, ready to go. The, the ports of call were awesome. The ports of call were the best. We didn't miss any ports. We went to every port. Um, our best port was Tortola because of the beach. beaches, the beach. but we went to St. Martin. We went to the Bahamas. I mean, everything was amazing. So Princess K Bahamas yeah. was their own, th their yeah. own island. Their own San Juan, island. Puerto Rico. We almost missed the ship. Ship, yeah. Uh, it was New Year's Day. Uh, the taxi guys, they were, you know, all taking a siesta. Four <laughs> ships. I mean, and I was thinking, like, why are we, well, you know, my wife's pregnant. And I'm like, why are we running three miles? Why do we have to do three miles in 30 minutes? Because literally at 5 p.m., you know, we, we hit up the, the beach, Coronado Beach. How do you say that? Coronado? Cor I just said yeah, Coronado. Coronado. Uh, Coronado Beach. Coronado. And, um, and like, we didn't go inside. It was a public beach. And then went to the Renaissance, had a couple of Coronas, you know, and they're on island time in Puerto Rico. And then all of a sudden, it's like, we can't get an Uber. It kept going up in time from 8 minutes to 10 minutes to 15 to 22 to 30. We're like, oh, my God. We need, to, we need to do something. What do we do? Well, we can't afford a chopper. I look at her, <laughs> and I'm like, hey, babe. <laughs> let's use what god gave us our legs and you know we hightailed it new year's day it was uh, three fun. miles <laughs> in to the to the port and then i'm like why is this like there's so much traffic on a on a new year's on new year's day right mm -hmm. was it a sunday or it was or a monday it was a monday Monday. it was a monday and yeah. i was like why is there so much traffic and um and you know it, it was a sunday i think it was, it a was sunday. sunday yeah i think it was a sunday but let me just check just to make sure yeah, it was a Sunday, New Year's Day, and I'm like, on yeah. a Sunday, why is there so much traffic? New Year's Day, was closed. four ships were in the in the cruise terminal: the a celebrity, an Oceana, us, the and princess, then the, what's the other one? Enchanted Princess, and then that one that keeps Royal Morello, Caribbean, Morello, Morello cruise, yeah. and so many. That's almost like twenty eight thousand people inundated that area in Old San Juan, Puerto Rico. So you know, luckily we missed it, but don't let me just tell you this: ninety minute rule, guys. Give yourself enough time to get back to the ship. Don't be like us and wake up at 11 o'clock or 10 o'clock. <laughs> wake up at 7 a.m. if you have to. You know, we're just relaxing. It's on vacation. We don't do excursions. Um, we just give a taxi guy. Talk to him. Talk to him. Take us here. Take us here. We Google our itinerary because we don't. Be, we don't be locked down to any structure. Like you got 10 minutes. Wrap it up here. Let's go here to the excursion. They take you back to the ship early. We just like to freestyle it, and you know, we really enjoyed it. What was your favorite island? Uh, my favorite island was Tortola because the beach we found was amazing. Yeah. Uh, but we're going to go into that, you know, during the video. But some of the points that I wanted to go over first is, you know, 
the food i'm going to go over all the food so we go through every single dining we did miss the gelato uh but you know i've heard really good things about the gelato they close at 10 p.m so we never really eat. made it's too much to eat um you know it's very british inspired so a lot of british kind of foods we also had um you know three speciality dining restaurants so make sure you make those reservations uh, what beforehand. was your favorite uh, special my dining? favorite speciality dining was actually the salty dog yeah. the, which was the burger spot <laughs> I typical mean... american <laughs> I, I, i'm gonna okay so out of the sabatini's the italian the bistro la mer the french one uh -huh. and the salty dog I have to go with salty dog. I'm sorry. Typical American here. Salty the, dog. The burger. I don't know. The lobster the mac and cheese was excellent. Uh, I was trying to find more lobster. I only found four pieces. But, um, <laughs> you know, I understand inflation's high. You know, we own restaurants and and uh, it's killing us, man. It's killing yeah. the small business owner. So, we understand. But, but, but the food was really hot. The service was great. Uh, a little slow, but, you know, they just got all slammed at once. Um, One you know, tip. We, I really like yeah. the main dining. Yeah, the main dining, what we I really like. the difference between Norwegian and this. Yeah, so, it you changed. know, we're used to, like, going to cruises where the main dining has different dishes. And so this one has a different menu every single day on main dining. And it's free. We did get to eat, uh, what, three times of the main dining or four times three of the main four, dining. Three or four, I can't remember. But every day there was, oh, like, a Oh, the crown grill, too. Sorry, yeah. about that. The yeah. crown grill was fun. So, anyway, let's go back to the main dining. <laughs> So the main dining has different uh, menu every single day, so you don't have to get bummed down with the same exact dish every day. The only reason why we wanted to try the speciality, just because they're different. So there's a steakhouse, an Italian place, uh, and a French place, and then the Salty Dog, which there's two. There's one in the Lido deck, which is like a quick kind of burger, hot dog, um, you know, you just pick it up and go. I should catch in my vote. Yeah, go ahead. I have to pick the crown. The crown girl. We yeah. went there twice. Because how much was the, the cover charge? It was only, for both of us, $58. Or... So 29 per person. Dude, to get a 22-ounce porterhouse steak at that quality yeah. and the hotness of the fries and mm -hmm. the food and the chef came oh, out and packed hungry, us. And then we just ate. <laughs> like, and then what the lamb chops. They brought the lamb chops back. The lamb we chops are back. Another cruise couple <laughs> that, that was on 50 cruises. 50 princess cruises. And, you know, they said, like, they took out the lamb chops for a while and... And I bit into that, oh, it was like heaven. And it's like, just melted in your mouth, the meat. It was mm. so delicious. Get it medium well. I like medium well. I just, you know, a little Some bit people are going to boo at that, especially if y'all are Texans. <laughs> I, 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 like, I, I used to like medium rare. I like medium well now. And plus, you know, with uh, foodborne illnesses, you know, food safety wise, I just prefer it a little more cooked. Mm -hmm. I haven't gotten diarrhea once. <laughs> I have a sensitive stomach. <laughs> But this is I have a, a better sensitive cruise. stomach, yeah. The food quality, the sticky toffee pudding. On the Lido sticky deck. toffee pudding was good. Lido Deck has different foods every day. They have Indian stuff as well, if you're into that. I mean, we didn't try the Lido Deck, but we did have like some desserts on the couple days and they were yummy. Um, so let's let's talk about the drink packages. They have three drink, drink packages, a soda package, a premium plus, and um, premier Plus. Premier Plus, that's what we had, yeah, we had the Premier, middle one. We had the middle one, so there's one higher than ours. So with the one that we had, the middle one, it was uh, $99 per day per person, and both of you all have to get it. Um, yeah. We actually got um, booked straight through the Princess website, and it was $64.96 for both of us. Mm -hmm. uh, $6,496. We're in a mini suite, M316. And um, two we, TVs. Had, we have two TVs. I'll do the room tour for uh, y'all. The balcony yeah. was good too. Beds are so comfortable. And then also I'm going to go over the room service. You can The room service is complimentary. We did breakfast every morning that was sent to our room. So they have like a generic breakfast tag, which I'll also show you in the video. But we just kind of added what we wanted. So they, have they like, brought it. Yeah, they bought everything. Dude, I, I I had crazy requests like yeah. fresh squeezed lime. They brought it. <laughs> they bought it. Okay, because my Poached doctor, eggs. My, my doctor, they bought it. They bought it. Poor guy ran like an hour up. Bacon sauce is not on the form. I got they it. They got it. You know, mm -hmm. and, and anything you write on there. Soy yeah. milk. They you, got it. You want a butterfinger? I mean, <laughs> by darn, the chef will try to put some butterfinger together for you. Like, I mean, these guys. They go above and beyond they, they re I really I really enjoyed it you know it's an awesome cruise awesome people 
uh, oh, the welcome drink. Like we didn't get a yeah. welcome drink on on the Norwegian beer. Yeah, but here, here we got a welcome drink. Our our awesome uh, butler Adira, he came in. Well, he's with, the housekeeping, and he's the butler, and yeah, he's the luggage guy. He's everything. Guy. He's, he's he's like just, four in one. And then like one night, one time we had a problem from with Indonesia. The, one time we had a problem with the breakfast not coming on time. Like it was a little bit late. I think that's the day we asked for like six poached eggs. So we called Adira and he quickly got on it and you know within like five ten minutes the breakfast was here um also just to let you know if you guys like massages we love Ooh, massages travel hack I, I, okay, I, go ahead. I just want to tell you about this one thing because yeah. it popped in my head and yeah. i forgot about it? it and i was waiting to tell you tell them uh -huh. the hundred shares of carnival oh yeah okay go, we go for this. it go no, for it well so we have a hundred shares of carnival you just need that minimum six weeks before prior to before you uh, make the booking um you know for princess cruise which is a carnival company um you own the 100 shares you just have to have those shares registered in your name whether it's 401k or whatever you fill out this form call carnival you can get that form at the guest services desk or anywhere on the ship or even online okay i'll look into that more and we'll, we'll show you the form but you fill that out and you get what two fifty or three hundred dollars on board credit for just a hundred shares, and it's at nine bucks a share. That's nine hundred yeah. bucks, and you get that you make that money back with the onboard credit. Yeah, that, you right away. That is the best travel hack that I've learned. Oh, and another one: if you also book, um, if you book a future cruise, we did that. You just we already did it. You That's just how put you know. We are, we're, we're, you know, I'm not scared to admit it. We're mm -hmm. we're bougie. We're <laughs> snobs. We're I think they already snobs. know that by now. We're like <laughs> up here. We, our expectation level, and you know what? Like we put that hundred dollar cruise de uh, deposit down. What does that tell you? Yeah. That and so Princess the hundred dollar cruise, cruise deposit go. basically goes towards any future cruises for two years and you get like Ooh, up to a hundred dollars uh, on board credit so you book a cruise you put a deposit for just a hundred bucks you have two years to book a cruise and with that cruise that you book you'll get a hundred up to a hundred dollars on board credit for that cruise and then if you don't use that hundred dollars you can years. cancel you it you get it back you get it back but so we did it and we, and you can even do it, it on the princess cruise app you have to do it on the app. You have to be on the ship to do it. Yeah. You can't actually do it at home. No. So that's something when you get on the ship, there's some things that you have to do when you get on the ship. Uh, book all your speciality dinings. Book the spa because we got a really good chef's deal. Chef's table. Chef's table. We didn't get to do chef's table because we were late. Uh, book chef's table. I think that's going to be really cool. That's like on level uh, seven at the Amalfi dining room. Um, and then also book the future cruise credit. Make sure you have your 100 shares of Carnival. Um, what else? Hey, and, and you yeah. know, we got on the first night and they said all the specialty dining, especially the Crown Girls, book for the entire cruise, no openings. And <clears throat> you can't get it. Yeah. Fully booked. Guess what? My friend, I don't know, it's not Andrew Jackson, I'm not that rich, but it's, uh, what's it's, the $10 bill? It, it's a $10, oh my uh, god, I can't well, believe we not don't Andrew know Andrew Jackson, this. who's the $10 bill in the five Whatever it was, <laughs> let me just tell you, five or ten buck, they, they go a long way, okay? And all you gotta do is sip the maitre d one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna name any names, but the one in the crown, and the crown grill, and... We got in there twice. We got in there on New Year's Day. Yeah. Um, you know, at least New we got Year's in Eve. New Year's Eve. Even yeah. when, when everything was booked. sold out. Yeah, we got there on New Year's Eve and then the first night. Um, I, I think they just, I, I don't think you're guaranteed a reservation if you tip them. They just give you priority. But yeah, they'll, so, help, they'll help you out. You know, you, you just like, I mean, the, the specialty dining, the, the price point, just a $25 cover to eat. All that food, great food, is such a good deal. I highly recommend it. But our main dining was awesome too. I Everything can't, I can't was hot. Oh my god, all the food was <clears> hot. <throat> I can. Oh my god, you have no idea when you you if you've watched <clears throat> my videos, you know that my food has to be piping I hot. And, and on the last you, cruise, it wasn't. It, the was last cruise, it wasn't. It was very disappointing. I had to return the food. They had to bring it back, but this time, like the food, without me even asking them, the food was just piping hot. But you like it because it tastes better, right? I love it. I but love the it. The thing it is, when, when you it's... get above 165 degrees Fahrenheit, mm. and all my brothers and sisters in the restaurant business know this, who's taken a basic food safety, <laughs> when you get above 165, guess what? It kills 80 or 90 percent of the bacteria. You have the least amount of bacteria possible. Yeah. Anything that falls below that danger zone 
Like you're asking for diarrhea. And that's so, why you got diarrhea on yeah. the Norwegian. Uh, there, there was cold, colder food, and, and that always concerns me. So Princess mm -hmm. really knocked it out of the park, you know, with the food. Um, there's like so many pros for this and thing. there's also like tiers too just like with every other cruise is tier so this is our first so we're just you know like the first uh, tier <coughs> we're but exploring it go yeah we're still exploring yeah. we're still going we're gonna go on a celebrity uh, next week seven days from seven now. days celebrity beyond. beyond it has a magic carpet so we're gonna go on that so you have to subscribe so you can obviously watch the videos yeah. but um, you I, was know, gonna, I was gonna say one more thing that yeah. the Norwegian yeah. versus this. Uh -huh. I want to. I didn't want to like say all bad things. One positive thing about Norwegian versus the princess, oh. the Wi-Fi. Yeah, the Wi-Fi. So much. Is the so Wi-Fi is not good here. I guess it's also a positive thing. You're not on your phone. Yeah. Looking at restaurant cameras, who doing what, <laughs> you know, stuff like that. Who needs to get written up? <laughs> yeah. Just kidding. Yeah. But we were Fire. able to process the You're payroll. Fired. We were able to do the schedule. That's, that's the only thing uh, that, you know, I, yeah. but it took longer than usual like the wi-fi we had the highest plan and it wasn't that good at all no. so that's probably one thing and the one guy said it was because of the medallions like these these things that open up your room which is a really cool feature yeah i'm gonna know go you're on the medallions. but i'm like well if you have this technology here this medallion technology mm -hmm. why do you have it it's interrupting with the wi-fi yeah i don't know if you use that excuse or if that's the truth but that's something they have to fix is the wi-fi I would just say that. Um, what other positives are? I mean, everything other than that was positive. They have an international cafe that's open 24 so hours awesome. with good food. Awesome food. Uh, you didn't hear this from us, but if you go to the Vista Lounge, they'll hook you up with more alcohol than you need. <laughs> I, I said hook it up, and they, <laughs> they pour it up to the rim. You know what they did We're about to him. head there right now for last night to get they, some. You know what they did for him? They actually opened a bottle. Fresh bottle. Fresh bottle, kept it at the site, and just poured it up for him. So, so just, just just tip these guys. You yeah. Know, if, just, you're, if you're blessed enough to go on this cruise. Then you, bl you can like Like this is what tip. I do. On every cruise, we just take $100, okay? We'll go to the bank, get singles, and each single person that serves on us or waits on us the in these restaurants, service, I give restaurant. them three bucks, four bucks, and I wire it up. At the end of the cruise, when hundred dollars gone, you know, it's gone. Like it's ten days, you know, think about it. It's ten bucks a day. Yeah, and, like it means it means the world to these guys. Uh, you know, it's just... don't go removing your gratuities. I think that's the dumbest thing that you well, can do. Unless, the service unless it was horrible. really bad. And like, give the specific people the money. But here, I'm leaving the gratuities yeah. on, and plus, on top of that, I gave him a couple books here and there, because, mm -hmm. I mean, I've never had such good service, you know. Yeah. One con, I would just say, versus, also Norwegian, had another plus, the Wi-Fi was one, and the second one, I just popped in my head. The drink. The cigarette smoke. Oh, yes. Okay. I, I don't know, this is a brand new ship, oh. 2020. The Norwegian is 2022, in their casino, they had a enclosed space with automatic doors that sealed, and the smokers were in there. I smoked for 10 years. I, I'm not, you know, trying to profile anybody or like, I don't want this. It's just, you know, there's other people on the ship. There's kids and, and in the main piazza here, you smell the cigarette smoke when you should be smelling jasmine, rose flowers, or, mm, you know, like you should be smelling smoke. the steak or like other smells. And it just turns off your appetite. It turns off even being in the piazza area. So, you know, like, yeah, you want to smoke, have designated areas enclosed spaces uh, secondhand smoke kills more than even first-hand smoke in some cases science has proved that mm -hmm. so my wife's pregnant we don't want to we want to heal that um that's only you know negative but other than that like i would go on a princess cruise again versus you know the other norwegian maybe if you guys have any idea uh, like if you guys can give us ideas of uh, princess cruises that you've been on yeah. that you like just drop a comment below oh a laundry i love the oh laundry. and then we have self laundry, laundry self laundry that Dude, was I, cool i'm a big guy i sweat like crazy <laughs> it stinks like bo here you know even my wife says dang like sometimes you you stink honey and i'm like god like i have to i have to use the sink you know kind of being cheap indian guy i gotta use the sink bring out my thing use their soap but this one has a laundry get some tokens with your medallion app you just go buy it it's like eight bucks and fifty cents for uh, yep. laundry and for washing and drying. Yeah, I'm gonna go so cool. through all and that in minutes. the video. Okay, yeah. All right, all right, guys. So keep on watching. There's a lot of information that we just went over, but the video is gonna go through everything in detail, 
and you can actually visually see it instead of seeing our faces all the all the time. But you want to see our faces. We want, <laughs> we want to talk to you guys so that you know we give our our experiences of traveling mm -hmm. and and you know we're giving the raw experience and the true experience and nobody can really buy us off. So yeah. you know I'm still gonna speak my mind and um, Princess is the way to go. Yeah. All right, so stay tuned and keep on watching. And Celebrity in seven days. Yeah, seven days. And don't Celebrity forget beyond with to the magic like, carpet. share, and subscribe. All right, guys. Peace. Peace. So here is our room. So this is cool because you don't need a room key and you just need the medallion. And actually, you don't even need that medallion token. You can just walk by or have it in your purse or your pocket and it will open the door for you. You'll see like a kind of locking or the, the door handle will turn green. So that's really awesome. There's a card there to make sure the lights and everything are on. Everything was super clean. The ship was actually... Uh, built in 2020 so it's a brand you know fairly brand new ship there's a full length mirror always need one of those to make sure your outfit is looking in tip top shape there's also laundry that they can do um, but there's also a laundromat which i'll go over soon they have robes which are really nice they're very thin they didn't have slippers but luckily i had my slippers from the hotel that we stayed at before there's a safe and then extra um you know storage area for like shoes and stuff and then the bathroom was fairly big so it actually had like soaps and uh like not bar soaps but shower gel body wash and then it had lotion so we were really happy with this this is a mini suite um we did pay 67 66 for this um, I think I believe I mentioned I said 64, but it's actually 67, 66 uh, for 10 nights. And um, it also included like the premium beverage package and, um, you know, really uh, oh good. Wi uh, the Wi-Fi, sorry, the upgraded Wi-Fi as well. And so we actually asked, asked for two separate beds only because I'm pregnant and I need like two pillows on my front and my back to sleep with otherwise we would have those put together the butler actually came and asked us if we wanted to put those beds together but we didn't want that so there's a lot of outlets you know you can put all your phone charging all your chargers on there it's an american and then also you can do like the british the 240 volt too so we had a beautiful balcony it has to be up ways Balsoni, and then this is Fort Lauderdale. And this is... Oh, can you move out of the way, babe? <laughs> room is actually meant for four people so that couch that you see is a pull-out bed and then there's two drapes at either side you can split the bed the bedroom in half and there's also two tvs so it's definitely made for four people for you ma thank you oh, oh you so too. nice <laughs> thank you so much we're honored that you chose to spend your value vacation time with us from our shoreside teams to our crew on board we're dedicated to making your princess experience personalized and hassle-free we want you to enjoy every minute of your dream vacation at Princess, we pride ourselves on places that help us forever. Our highest priority. Breads. Sandwiches. Oh, we have tandoori chicken. <laughs>
beverage packages for the New Year then? So again, uh, it's uh, it's available in any of the bars. Any of our bar staff would give you that information. So we will also have uh, an inquiry desk on deck five uh, at the atrium. So feel free to pass by and uh, ask any questions. Super, super. Now I know you are also test. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. I don't bite. I don't bite. <laughs> Oh, this is just candy and stuff. Oh yeah, definitely. Like that. Another little kid here. Yeah. What else do you want, babe? The internet cafe. <laughs> <laughs> cigarettes smoking in this place he's drinking water because he drank too many drinks Oh, you can only get one item. Really? Yeah, if 
you want more, it's ten dollars extra. What does it say there? At the bottom. Breads with the olive oil. And then these are the mozzarella. And this is the salad. You gonna take a bite of it or yeah. what? <laughs> you want me to put some oil in the vinegar? Uh, you're doing the video? No, you do it. Yeah, I want to show you the yeah. cool, the cool bottle. Yes. That's a cool bottle. It's a, like a two-part bottle. Yes, two in one. Yeah. Ooh. Thank you. All right, so this is a burrata with green tomatoes. Pretty cool. All right, and what is this? The salumi plate. This is the cold cuts, yeah. The meat plate. <laughs> why? Wait, why did you do that? We didn't cut it out. Yeah. It's funny. And then here, smell to us. <laughs> smells like Italy. <laughs> Tastes like Italy? Mm. Okay. Alright, this is a pappardelle with bolognese. Yes, please. Thank you. And then that's the carbonara. Yeah. Mm. Fresh pepper and lasagna. Mm -hmm. I know I'm good. Extra cheese. Please. Ooh, cheesy. Is it hot? So good. Yeah. And then I got the chicken. Thank you. Happy anniversary. Happy anniversary. Thank you. Happy anniversary to you. Thank you. Too. <laughs> So you got the chef special, so you got all four of the desserts. So that's the rocher, and I got the big one. You always get the big one. Yeah, I got the big ball. <laughs> the big chocolate ball. You wanna break ball. into that? Yeah. Ooh, what is inside it? Ooh, chocolate like ice, ice cream. cream. That looks freaking delicious. Oh, it is. So basically, madam, that uh -huh. one is the rocher, the mini version of rocher. Uh -huh. After that, the one is a vanilla panna cotta with blueberry compote. Okay. Followed by the sabayon marsala. Uh -huh. So that one is made of egg yolk with marsala wine. And the last one is the tiramisu. Ooh, yummy. Really, Thank this you. Is really Yeah. Yeah. I can't get it all. Yeah. 
Occasion and you know me and you phone to me and then we uh, we discuss. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the Chinese. Uh, yummy. All right, this is the goat cheese salad with red wine dressing. Porterhouse. Medium. The house, medium. Oh yeah, moo. <laughs> and then nice. I got the Kansas City strip. You wanna cut it for for the people? Oh yeah, he did say it was gonna be a little tougher. It is. It's real tough. Oh dang, you can't even oh okay. Oh not bad. It's medium. Looks a little bit more than medium, but it's good. I didn't want it too raw anyway. So my recommendation for you, yeah. here we go, a little bit here on the side. Okay. So you can, all of them are deeper, so you will love it. And you here just kind of dip it in the steak or? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, just touch. Right? Okay, okay. Here we go. Awesome. Oh, sir, for you. Side. Side here. Yes. Here. Trifle. Creme brulee cheesecake. Ooh. Creme brulee cheesecake. And this one, very nice. The one. key lime pie. The best oh, one. Wow. Oh, yeah, yeah that does look nice. Enjoy. Ooh, yummy. Very good Thank you very much. No Thank you. Enjoy. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Tartare. Ooh, look at that egg on there. Ooh, yummy. Take some of this. Some of that beef. Tuna? No, tuna tartare or steak tartare? Steak, sorry. Oh, steak tartare. Sorry, guys. Steak, steak tartare. Beef. Ooh. Whoa. Dang, that's what you call complimentary Ooh. bread right there. Wow, <laughs> wow it's hot. Ooh, they Piping look really hot, hot though. You may not. Is it really hot? Dang, let's see. Ooh. Medium all done. Medium well. Look at that dripping. Dang, that's delicious. Really delicious. Rhubarb cobbler. Mm -hmm. And here goes nothing. Mm. Cobble it up. Is it chocolate cake? Oh, okay. Looks like raspberry. With some vanilla ice cream. Ooh. Don't get it on your beard now. Mm -hmm. This is excellent. Is it? Oh yeah, the server recommended it. And he's gonna keep his job tonight, guys. <laughs> what about this one? Oh, this one has macaroons I on there. I think we'll This one delicious. has like macaroons, like so many. No, two. A little stiff. <laughs> oh, really stiff. Straight out the fridge. Oh shit, they're like frozen. <laughs> See what? Good. They probably had to let it defrost a little bit. Oh, the macaroons are yummy. Good. Mm -hmm.
on the other side where the guy is as a hairdresser we do hair okay so they do for four more nights and they do cut and color over there okay. and on the other side they do um teeth whitening okay so if you want to get rid of your stains like a okay. coffee and wine i'm uh, a wine drinker yeah. sometimes yeah. <laughs> if you want to get rid of there's a guy that does that like okay you. and here this is where we give the um, Fire and ice pedicure. This is very peculiar called okay. fire and ice pedicure. It's almost like getting a facial on your okay. on your face. Okay. They use hot stones and cooling gels uh -huh. to create the fire and the ice experience. Okay. And where they are going right now, uh -huh. the main cave. That's right here? Oh, for men. Man cave. Man cave. I'm going to show you. 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 Okay. So that's just. Okay. They give you an arm and scalp massage. Okay. So it's Ian who does it and it's all the way from India. I'm Oh, cool. Well, I think she tenderized me. He does like Botox and all that? Yes. So here he does more than just Botox. Uh -huh. He does the match and he does um diaspora and restaurant. Okay, cool. He's loved by his guests. I always yeah. see them hugging him up. So he must be yeah. That's Dr. Lewis oh, there. That's Dr. Lewis, okay. Yeah, he's, he's, he's the one that's going to fix you up. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to make you yeah. look 20 years he's younger. Well, you know about it. Were you a spa therapist before? No, I just know. Uh, we're from uh, um, Texas. And ah. I don't want to say this, but everyone gets there. You know, everyone's so young. Hello. Okay. So in here, oh. we just have... Um, hold on. Somebody's calling. Not for me, for the manager. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. oh. So this is what they do anyway. This is, for, this is part of the fitness, guys. Okay. So they do something up in the gym. This is to let you know about the schedules and then the, what seminars we'll be holding. Okay. But the gym is in deck 17. Okay. Yeah. Gym is in deck 17. So where are the elevators? Uh, to the end. Okay. I'll take you all the way back again. Okay. So this is the spa. What massages do you usually like? Uh, I like uh, just regular Swedish massage, probably like more, like 80 minutes, 90 minutes, okay. long ones. Oh, you sound so good. Are you sure? I love long, <laughs> I love long massages and I, I like like gentle ones, not yes, like, like rough ones. Swedish yeah, Swedish. <laughs> okay, come through. So this is uh, our island famous. Okay. And this is Jin. Okay. Oh, hi. We actually have three Zimbabweans on board for the okay, first time awesome. in my life. I yeah. Any... You, you can come through. Okay, yeah. What is, so what, room, what is this in this room? Okay, so this is Anastomi. What is that? For cellulite reduction. Oh, if you okay. want to get rid of the cellulite okay. around okay. your body. Okay. And if you want to slim out and torn the okay. muscles, this okay. one, it works. Okay. It also helps to remove any toxins, okay. toxins that you have. You want to get that done, man? Get some abs, Sonia. <laughs> get some abs. <laughs> well, where I come from, this time, if you have a tummy and you're a man, you call you a rich man. Yeah. But because you boss, boss, boss. Yeah, that's because what they, they call know. him. Yeah, boss. because they know. Everyone, boss. <laughs> he calls everyone boss and no, they no, call no. him boss. Where I come from in Zimbabwe, you are the boss. Wherever he goes, boss. boss. We're actually from, uh, our family's from Kenya. Oh, really? Yeah. How interesting is yeah, that? Yeah, we have a. Oh, we don't know. Who come to the service? For the past five years, I quite specialize in this. What this kind of massage? Oh, so wow. this is where you actually come in. So yeah. you usually get a massage, like a normal massage, just yeah. to make your muscles relax. So here, before we give you that massage, we're going to detox your body. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So how does it work? Very easy. You know, see with uh, what? Let's say, for instance, if you're mm -hmm. feeling tired, if mm -hmm. you you know you have knots in your muscles, mm -hmm. in your shoulders, if you maybe tightness of the muscles, it just means that your body is a little bit more acidic. You know the pH balance, like mm -hmm. not let your body go too acidic or mm -hmm. too alkaline. So it happens, I mean, with anything. Stress, overworking, over exercising, mm -hmm. maybe not getting enough rest. So what you have to do, you come through here. I'm gonna put seaweed all over your body, it's 97% oh, wow. alkaline, and I'll drop you in here. There's oh, more water there. Cool. So for 30 minutes you detox. Oh, wow. For 30 minutes you detox and okay. you soften the muscles. You take a shower, then I give you to a preference, will be a nice mm -hmm. 
Swedish massage or we do a deep tissue massage. Okay. So that that was a massage, you get both a deep massage. Yeah. 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 So here's the couple's massage room. So Novel's getting the Steeweed massage wrap. I'm getting the 100 minute massage. Uh, and that's the underwear he has to wear. <laughs> Shorts. And then they give us the, a, a, a bath after, like, and then you get like 60 minutes of downtime. Here are the packages. So we chose the first package, so the ultimate indulgence for $5.89. But those are some. Nice underwear. Yeah. Yeah. So this is a duty free. Like, get up if you want to eat something. Yeah. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Would you like oh. some water? Yeah, bottled water. Water, water, water? Yes. Okay. Anything else from the bar? Uh, and I'll take a. Uh... Oh, you like uh, yeah, sure. What is that mean? That is a uh, crab artichoke dip with plantain chips. Pen pasta. Uh, yeah. The pen pasta. Yeah. Almost gone. Coffee, decaf coffee. The next thing, because COVID started you. working up again, we were less than 40. Thank you. It was almost the staff one on one to the passengers. Oh. It was so incredible. Oh, I kept awesome. on looking for my for, for, for my uh, crew staff number every morning. I'd wake up and say, which one of Longbow, Heineken, and what was the other beer? Uh, a blonde, but they don't. Okay. I for my a blonde, but they don't have it. Oh, okay. So they didn't have the blonde, but you get three that are included in the eighteen dollars. What kind of cheese it is? But it's like a salty Gruyere. It's fresh bread. Ooh. Oh, that was cheesy. This is yummy. <laughs> Exceptionally good. Cheese soup. Ooh. With little grilled cheese sandwiches to dip it in. Oh, Ooh, that's a lobster mac and cheese. Oh man, that looks yummy. Oh. Got to tear that up. Oh yeah. It was hot. Hot. It was hot. 100% steak beef. Ooh, got some. They got some bacon on here. Ooh, yummy. Looks like oh. What? what? Look at this thick ass bacon. Oh, dang. Yeah. Oh, whoa, that's a nice piece Ugh, of bacon. Thick piece of, of bacon. And then we got some jalapenos, some whoa. deep fried jalapenos on it. So. How are you going to take a bite out of that one? I don't know how it's going to fit in my mouth. I don't know how to make it fit. <laughs> Let's see. Look, at the, look at this bacon. Dang, that's a I'm going to go burger. for the bacon. Okay. Oh, whoa. Mm. That looks yummy. Yummy. Dang. The juices burn me. Oh. <laughs> See that one down my thumb? Okay, so I got the fried chicken burger. It's a little bit plainer. Uh, it's not as juicy as his. It just has like lettuce, tomato, and fried chicken, and then a side of fries. So we're gonna dig in. Fries, sweet potato fries. Whoa. Mm -hmm. 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 Mm -
got the seafood. Ceviche with palmada olives, rock calamari. shrimp, rock shrimp and fresh shrimp. Okay. Mm -hmm. This. And then this is the mama's meat lasagna. Thank you. And then that's the lemon cheese cheesecake. This is a pear flambe. And then this is the amara. Yeah, creme brulee amaretto. So like that's so we were like three miles away and we're like okay well what should we do? So we just start walking and we're like okay and then it just goes up to twenty minutes, it goes up to thirty minutes and then you know it's already like four thirty and we're like three miles. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. I, I, I don't know if we'll be around. It'll be possible. Don't think of something. Technology. I mean, um, like, no, we can, like, nickel and dime you and try to rip you off. This one looks a little bit burnt, but it'll work. And then this is, like, the apple torch. Wood lime. Yeah. But also chilled noise. This is a Thai chili soup. Yeah, last time. Shaved coconut fruit salad. Mm. The vegetable for try it. Is it anything like you? No? <laughs> what does it taste like? Mm, it tastes like a soup. Soup? That's not a core mom. One out of ten. It's a one. <laughs> oh, sorry, man. Out of ten is a one. Alright, this is my steak sirloin strip. It's American, so I'm sure it will be good. The scallops. Is that better than the forma? Don't worry, we got you covered. Yeah. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Okay, good. Parmesan chicken. Oh, I was thinking of it. Chuso, chocolate gelato. Ooh. Mm. That's really good. The creme brulee, coconut creme brulee, and then the New York cheesecake. Okay, these are the mango samosas. Ooh. Hmm. They look more like empanadas, but let's try. What this kind is of chutney? How's the texture? They look kind of doughy. They're decent. They're decent? The texture is good. Really? But mama's samosas are always the best. Pinto fries and then the olives. Marinara sauce. Mm -hmm. Good? So that's that and that. Are you sure? Ooh, spinach. And what is this one? Ooh, would be I don't know. seared oh, salmon. Yeah, seared salmon. Seared salmon with cheese and that does balsamic vinegar. Balls? Let's find out. Oh, it's the ice cream. Yeah, it looks yeah. really good. Also, the eggs. Ooh. Look at that, would you? Yeah. And then this is the veal. Yeah. Ooh, and veal cutlets and a white cream sauce. Ooh. It's a 
cut it. And then the rice pilaf. Yummy. That's delicious. 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 One. No, we like to go to restaurants too. Yeah, I don't know what the name is. It's Peruvian one. Uh, right, okay, yeah. I like to go to restaurants. And then this is the meringue. Yeah. But I mean, I would miss my family. Ooh. Did you just like to go? Well, fluffy. You get used to it, believe me. Me, even. No, it's real. I can taste it. Yes. I can taste it. So I was expecting for the, the bones. Yeah. They mm -hmm. want to come in the galley to see. So a cool feature is that you don't even need your medallion. As long as you're here, it'll just kind of unlock it for you. How cool is that, right? So you don't even need to use your medallion. And then it changed a lot. Changed in a bad way? Yeah. Homeless? Well, we have a lot. You know, it tells you how many times, you know, for a washer and dryer, you would need two because you would want a washer uh -huh. and one dryer, you know, so you would need two. And then for the vendor products, I mean, do you want, you know, oh, okay. this one is, uh, so, you know, you can, this one has bleach in it, no. this is regular, and this is dryer sheets. Okay, so we'll need one so, of these. One of these. Yeah, so two, okay. and then you hit two, and then you purchase now. There you go, and it's processing. And there are your awesome. tokens. <laughs> See the big ones you yeah. use for the drum, for the wash. And these ones you use for this. Yeah. So you just push it in here. You know? Okay. The big one, that one. Uh, yes, this one. You put in here, you know? You add the detergent, so you get a detergent, whichever one you okay. want. Yeah, some people prefer this, some people prefer this. That one has bleach. Yeah, that's white. Yeah, exactly. Then you push it in. There you go. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah, and then the same here, you know, for your dryer sheet, you put in one before you use it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's awesome. And there are your dryer sheets. Oh, yeah. So oh, you just add, you know. You add your detergent. I added detergent. Should be the cruise director. <laughs> yeah. cool. you, you add your detergent. Mm -hmm. Watch, there might just be a little package inside or two packages inside. You know, I don't know, I haven't used this one. Do your clothes in bed? Yeah, mine are all in. So you just, you know, yeah. do it like, you know. This yeah, is they cool. Could just yeah. For that much, it's not that bad, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're yeah. good. You close it, and then what do you cold. want to use? Cold? Cold is the best, yeah. Okay, so you have it. You push this in. Uh -huh. Push it. Oh. Push in. Like an arcade. That's it. It's in use. Awesome. It's super easy. Yeah. You also have an iron as well. So you can so basically, the laundry takes about 30 minutes, dryer takes about 40 minutes. Um, really cool. If you need to call someone and say, hey babe, you better get your butt over here because your clothes are ready and you can iron them yourself. <laughs> but we're gonna go take a shower and then we'll be back to collect our laundry and then stick it in the dryer. All right. So we're at Amalfi again. This is the lobster and shrimp bisque. And then this is the seared salmon and lobster. So that's a typical espresso. It might be hot. It's a wedge salad. Perfect. Comes with a nice juice. Oh, and then the lobster tail. Did you want pepper? I'll take a little bit. A little bit? Sure. And then this is a salmon. What is this? Huh. 
A little bit more. What is this one? The salmon. salmon? Oh, just salmon? Okay. Uh, yeah, sure. Chocolate filling. Chocolate. Yeah. This is Crips the Crips is it. The pistachio dome. And then the creme brulee. Make sure that people in the back can hear me. Welcome to our Super Shopper raffle. Has everyone had a good cruise? Yeah. You win to be excited about it. I want to hear you scream. I want to hear you hoot. I want to hear you holler. I want you to hear like you just won a thousand dollars. Also, it was not in my hand, it was stuck to the other. So, the one in my hand. Who must be present. How many of you here are on Kareem deck? Oh. Now, guys, really quickly, really quickly, may I see your medallion? It's not that I don't trust you, but I'm pretty sure. So here are some of their room service items. I ordered a lot so you can kind of see what kind of food they have. Um, it took an hour. I ordered it at 1.45. It's now 2.45. So it takes a while. I got the chef salad. Um, let's see. And then obviously all the sides right here. And then we have, hmm, what is this? Okay, so these are the loaded cheesy fries. Looks like those um, Taco Bell nacho cheese fry things. And then we have a hot dog. And then the sides, you can add on whatever sides you want to, you can request those. And then we have the chicken salad sandwich. The food so far has been really good on this ship, so I'm really happy about that. Um, and then I got, oops, oh, the four bottles of water. You can get maximum four bottles. And then I got like a soup. Yep. All right. There you go. All right, so our overall cruise review category rating for this Princess Enchanted cruise was the ports were amazing, the toiletries were great, the staff was good, the speed of service was excellent, all the activities on board were amazing, the bars, everything, the food and the drinks was really good, everything was super clean, the pool, the gym, everything was really clean, the mattress was amazing, and honestly, even though we spent almost seven grand, the overall value was really, really good for what we got. I would definitely recommend going on this cruise again. Our cruise review rating was 96%. All right, guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe so I can continue making awesome videos. Bye-bye.